Boom! What up? Solar Renekton only here back doing some more League of Legends action. We're playing some more Vigar in the top lane. We're going for a tank Vigar build. Last time we did the on hit Vigar. We're going to switch it up. Get real tanky. We're against Adarius. He has Storm Raider Surge and he has Ghost. And I'm assuming he's like sitting in this bush. Yep! Because they always try and cheese. Ooh, get poked, brother. And I get that minion. Perfect. So yeah, the whole point of this is we're going to be stacking up uh, all this free AP off of minions like that, or when we hit a champion with our ability. So that's how it works. So you see that three? That's the extra AP that we've gained so far, which is actually absurd because it gets over like 300, maybe even 400, depending on how long the game goes. And that's 6,000 to 8,000 additional gold, which is actually insane. So, oh, lame. Got it. And his auto attack is really smooth. That's why we did the on hit build last time. So yeah, the build for this game is going to be Morella Namacon. So we get CDR and we can spam out our abilities and some mana regen back. And then after that, we're going for the Warmogs plus um, Spirit Visage combo. And then we might get like a Death Cap because by then we'll have a billion AP. And the whole reason it works is because you get so much free AP off of your uh, passive. So you can do like that too, where I kill a minion and I hit him. That works as well for giving two stacks. Uh, I don't know. Oh yeah. This actually might work though. When he goes for this one. Here's a troll build for you. Play Shen and build only items with shields. Like Face of the Mountain, Bloodthirster, Ma, Locket, and then last item Ga. So many shields Ooh. to break, lol. Or full AP oh, shit, Shen, your ULT will save about 1500 damage. Oh boy, that's bad. Oh, nice! Okay, I'll take it, I'll take it. Damn, I took one tower shot and that's what screwed me. Because I had grabbed. I needed a back out before the grab came. That was the issue. Alright, let's grab this and come back to lane. Go like this. Lame! Damn, that would have been so good. Hold up. I might be able to make a play on this goofball. Ooh, I was looking for it. Alright. Damn, I forgot how short Zach's jump is at early game levels. Like, I made a play for Zach that was like... Yeah. Uh, I don't know about this. Can't really help. I just want to shove the wave in. Perfect. That way it gets uh, I get a bounce. He's going to come back top. And that's why we want it to bounce. Because if he freezes it out, I get really screwed. Ooh, I can rotate down. I can come here. What's the chance he's just sitting in this bush? Yeah, I'm ready. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. We can make something happen. Oh, that was so perfect too. Lame. Alright, we forced out Flash. Worth it! Let's time that shit. Any Flash. Might as well pop this. Scout out for a ward. There's no wards top. This wave's slow pushing out, so like I said, I've missed three melee minions right now. Not an issue at all. It's only a tiny bit of gold. It lets me get a roam that blows out Flash that can be executed on later and get a kill off of it. And then I come back to a wave that I'm not getting punished with, you know? Like, he's not freezing me under his tower. I'm not losing more minions than uh, he is. So I come back pretty much okay. We already have 28 free AP. That's like I bought in one of these. Plus 8 AP. Like, this gives you 20 for 400 gold. I have 28. You're starting to see how ridiculous this is. You just get, you just get so much free uh, AP. And this attack speed is uh, actually pretty decent. Or his attack animation. Another one where we get two AP off of that because I tagged him in additional in addition to killing the minion. Oh, I'm in a bad spot. Oops. I shouldn't have walked how I did. I actually opened myself up to getting like engaged on. I'm fine just freezing this. Yo, thanks for subbing. Appreciate that. Yeah, I'm fine just freezing this out. And just stacking up AP. Oh baby, hell yeah. Can a minion acquired. Gotta be careful, there's a giant wave right now. Ooh. Oh! No, it's slow. Oh god. 
Get both of those. Let the minion hit. Nice! Alright, I got my ult now, so I do a lot of damage. He could still be waiting in this bush. I'm not really sure. I can always check it like that. Yeah. I was correct. He was doing something goofy. Let's see what he does. Ooh. Oh, I don't have mana for ult. Holy moly, no way. <laughs> I went oom. Um. I've been trying to spam my Qs to get stacks. Oh, man. That's horrible. That sucks. That was our play to capitalize on the flash that we blew early. Damn. Alright, let's get this wave shoved under fast. I think I got it completely under. I can back right here if it is. Nice. Ooh, tower is so close to dying. Uh-oh. That's not looking too good. Actually, I should go for the mana one first. This. This. Get boots here. All he's trying to do is catch me, so if I have boots, he won't be able to. Ah, damn. It was actually going somewhat decent for them, but then War came and destroyed their lives. They came so close to getting on this tower, too. Pretty big lead for them down in bot lane. I mean, they're up 20 CS. Like, sure, that play went really poorly, but they're up 20 CS, and they're about to... Literally, when they come back, they can push out this wave and then take that tower. Uh, we can probably kill this dude, to be honest. He's got his movement speed now, so that's a little... iffy. But he's going to have to walk up for these minions, and that's where we're going to make a play on him. Oh, that sucks. I should have waited. Oh, he can grab out of that? No way. That's sick. <laughs> Beast plays, though. I didn't realize he could grab out of that. That's pretty sweet. Grab the jump midair. That's really cool. Oh, I think he knows what's happening. I need to push so I can help. Yeah, he just warded the... He just warded this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm coming. He's... Oh, no. Never mind. I'm here with you. I don't know where mid is, though. Hmm. He has no ultimate though. Oh, this is good. Ult this. I can just chase him. Whoa, what is this? I can eat, I can eat, I can eat. Yeah, our team is so good, dude. Oh, uh, dude, our co our team combo is so good. We have like a million tanks, or a million like shields, and a million like knockups and stuns. We have so much CC and so much tankiness. And like CC adds tankiness because if you're stopping your opponents from hitting you, obviously you're not you're not taking damage, right? So CC is almost like a form of tankiness. That's why you see all these big CC tanks. Nice. Yeah, I'll take that play. I'm gonna Emax second here. Do you actually need help? Dude, you guys can do that by yourself. What are you pinging me for? Alright. Get this wave shoved in. I can rotate now. I could TP here. It's just not very good, actually. There you go. I'm coming down. I'm here to help, just in case. Otherwise, I'll just back. Go back to the base. Should be pretty solid. I'm not going to be able to take mid. They might try to, though. But they won't get it. Alright, so I got a bunch of C uh, CDR here, too. 15% I'm rocking. Just going to rocket for him. Yeah. Just clear out the wave real fast. They can't dive him. He has no mana. Swain is oom. Um. Yeah, Swain's oom, um, so you're fine. There's nothing they can do there. I don't want mid. I know. But it's probably better that this guy splits and you stay mid with the support. It's actually much better that that happens. Because <laughs> bot is a long lane right now. You don't want to be down there. Like, he doesn't... The Jinx doesn't want to be down there. It's a long lane and you're playing a champion without any escape abilities. It's like a terrible mix. Ooh. Well, that was a play, certainly. <laughs> 
I mean, I'm not walking anywhere near Darius. I'm literally sitting max range, pressing Q. So, that's why this matchup's fine, because Darius can't really do anything to me. I just sit back, press Q, stack up AP. I literally have four amp tomes worth of AP right now. Off of my passive. Kind of insane. We can make a play on this guy soon. Oops. Jungler is here. All in. I'm pretty sure he knows. Action in mid lane, though. Hopefully he walks up and get a good angle. Always getting, always trying to get two every single time. Because it hits uh, double, right? So I can either hit a minion or... Well, I can hit two minions or I can hit him plus a minion. I mean, or I could miss, obviously, but... <laughs> That's why this matchup's solid. Because I can stay out of range of that. Pretty damn easy. His grab's really short range. It's good on, against champions that are like also short range. Like Gnar. Gnar is super short range. Solid against him. Obviously any melee matchup is really good against. Damn, I'm trying to tag him with it. But he's sitting off to the side. I'm like Nasus, basically. Infinite stacker. I'm up in CS. And then you gotta remember that I have five amp tomes right now. Five additional amp tomes off of my passive. Like, Darius, when he fully stacks his, his passive, he gets, like, 200 AD. But I have this on every spell, and I don't have to stack up anything. See the difference? Oh, shit, that's bad. He can make a play off of that. I have to sit back and be really careful right now. Because he can pop Ghost and, like, go ham. Yep. He's trying to bait me with the uh, minion. So I can just sit back do this. See you, nerd. Do I TP? Nope. Alright, I'm gonna go war to this. We have the wave crash under tower. Perfect. Still gotta be careful about this guy. Tag him with the Q. Alright. Our spacing is pretty good. Up 20 CS right now. I can back get my item here. I'd like to be able to get boots too, but... It's not necessary. I could actually just stay and do another wave, to be honest. Like, he really can't do anything against me. He just warded. That kind of tells me his jungler is probably nowhere near. Like, why would he ward that if his jungler is, like, chilling up here, ready to gank me? So you can kind of infer a little bit that no one's around. Plus, I still have teleport if I need it. I'm going to grab this plus boots here. And then we should be good to go into our war mogs and then visage this. Let me get CDR boots. Perfect. I do have teleport. Just iffy at the moment. If they overcommit into this choke, I can teleport right here. That's generally how you want to use your teleports. I'm TPing in. They didn't really over well, they kind of overcommitted, I guess. Gotcha. I was about to flash for it, but did not have to. I'm coming this way. Oh, could have kept chasing. Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. All I have to do is put him inside of it. And then he dies. Oh, or not. The thing is, it's like almost back up already. Yeah, just put him inside the hole. Woo! Jesus! Let's get out of here, boys. A bit risky, but we knew where everybody was. We already killed their mid lane, so he couldn't be there. Darius is up in top lane. I'm just gonna back right now. Get the hell out of here. Oh, God. Yeah, no thanks. No thanks. Not trying to fight that. Head back to top lane. Look at this. 145 AP already. That's <laughs> so stupid. Oh, man. All right. Start going. I'm actually just going to finish my CDR right now. So I'm going to grab this for the war mogs, obviously. Perfecto. So I'm at 45% CDR now. Really good. 8 second, 8.8 .8 second on this. And it's a 2.5 second stun. It's not maxed yet. It needs two more points. So the CDR, will, the cooldown will get lower. And the stun duration will go up. At max, it's 2.5 second stun. So super huge. Then obviously this is a 2 second CD. So that's good too. Uh, you might get this if he W's. Uh, 
Probably not worth it. Oops. He gets hit in this bush. I'm gonna W it. W gives you a little bit of vision, so it's good to check. Instead of face checking stuff. I'm wondering if he's gonna walk up for it. I got a buddy up here. Let's go, baby. Come on now. That that super low cooldown on my E. That's ridiculous. Saves my ass. <laughs> but I R'd his R, so I killed him before he got the damage off on me. I should have had my potions taking. That's a big mistake. I probably could have regen like 150 health there. Ooh! Get it! Is this gonna kill? It's close. If I can get into range to E. The cleanse. Oh. Oh, it's so close. My E was almost back up. Uh-oh. We're in trouble here. Come this way. Come this way. Got a stun for you. Stun doesn't pull uh, tower aggro. Oh, shit. Oops. Alright, I'm leaving. <laughs> Not trying to die. Get me out of here. My tower is so low, though. I feel like my team is going to do something dumb. Go to aggro. Get popped. And he's sitting right there. I can just walk up. So my E. I'm watching you, goofball. Boom! Wow, we are smoking these people. And he's still looking for the flash. I legit just zoned Annie that entire fight. Oh, that's not good. Oh! Close one. Oh, no. Need just one more hit. Yeah, Cog's alive. Ooh, just trying to tag him there. 212 AP. Woo! That's some good shit. Oh, so close. Alright, let's get out of here before War comes and kills us. I don't think you want to be here, dude. <laughs> yeah, I don't think you want to be here. That blocks off this whole zone, makes him have to kite through that little choke. That gives us some distance away from him. And it's already back up in three seconds. That's so dumb. Like, watch. I put it down, right? The cooldown starts while it's down. And then if they hit it, even up to that edge point, like if they just hit it right there, 2.5 seconds done. Well, 2.2 until next level. Okay. Oh, damn, I can't sell it yet. Lame! This really sucks. I'm just gonna wait for it and sell this. It's only like 20 gold at that point. 30 gold. Yeah! I don't have enough levels yet to have <laughs> to activate this shit. But it's alright. We'll have it activated when we get our uh, Visage. Well, I actually didn't need CDR boots because I was gonna cap with this plus Visage. Yeah. So you need 2700 for it to activate, but I don't really care. I probably should have went Visage first and then got it after. That way I would have had it. Plus, you're supposed to run um, Scaling HP Yellows. So that put me at like 2400 right now. So I'd literally get the extra, well, a little bit less. So I'd get the extra health from this item and then, yeah, ready to cap out. But it's not a big deal. Woo! Play's trying to be made. All we have to do is ball up. I don't think they can deal with us. Yeah. Oh, baby. Boom! I might be able to penta here. Dang. Oh, that was like half a second off. That sucks. Bro. These are not the droids you were looking for, brother. 
<laughs> I'm tanky as fuck, dude. You ain't hurting me. I got mad health. True damage doesn't do anything. Oh, God. Oh, he actually got through that? I can't walk up yet. I have red buff on him. Oh, man, again. I'm just slightly off with these. Let's roll, boys. Nice. We can drag. Let's drag. Drag reset. That's definitely the call here. It's also super early in the game, so I don't have a lot of levels, so... Like, you get levels... Or, sorry, you get health every time you level up. If you didn't know. You get armor, you get health, you get magic resist, depending on the champion. Pretty damn solid. But yeah, we have 250 AP here. That's like 4,000 something gold, 5,000 gold. You can do the math, like... 20 AP is for 435 gold, so do the math on how much that is. It's a lot. It's a lot. Okay. Grab this. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, see, I'm supposed to have scaling health yellows, I just forgot. Feels bad. So I'm not activating it, the healing yet. It doesn't matter, though. I'll get it soon. I just need to finish this item and I'll be good. Finish the item, by then I'll have like two more levels and I'll hit the 2700. And have enough HPs. But I should have, like I said, I should have went Visage first. So I'm not getting a lot of value out of the activation here. Oh! Come on! It's like 0.1 second off, dude. Not even. He's gonna steal it from me! Wow, scumbag. We should try and do this. We just saw somebody back. We just do it. Oh, JK, JK. Uh, we can probably do it, to be honest. You have spam shields. I can just keep this covered. I just walk at them, they can't do anything. <laughs> choke off. Close off the choke point again. Nice! There we go, max E. 7.7 .7 second uh, CD. We just send everybody top one mid. Get this all shoved out. Okay, nice. Yeah, see I'm at 2500 off that level up. So I gained like almost 90. Yeah. Bloop. Mo AP. All I have to do is let my team pressure that wave. And then I can just sit mid and cover these people. And then go like this and pressure. Because I peel some of them off, and if they're getting peeled off, that means they can't really defend the tower. And we're getting free hits. Like, see how this guy keeps getting peeled off? Uh-oh. Oh! He's too fast. <laughs> that poor little guy. So long, sucker! I have E up soon. All I have to do is just get him in the circle. Combo! Godlike. Get him in the circle. And then you see, so I put him in the circle, right? And then I trap him into a spot with my W. Woo! Oh, he's gonna grab me! Chill with that, bros. Look at this CC chain, dude. Uh-oh. I'm way too tanky. Not tanky enough. <laughs> oh, man. So, yeah, the finished build would have been get my spirit visage right there. I didn't need CDR boots, so I could have even done, like, uh, spell pen boots, merc treads or something. I didn't need CDR boots. I mean, it helped in the early game, but I could have just got a Kindle gem or, like, double kin you know, get one Kindle gem, finish that item, and get the second Kindle gem for my next item, right? So, I could have done that. Would have been real nice too. Oh yeah, qualifiers. But yeah, this build's pretty solid. Uh, especially in top lane. Because like I said, you just get free AP all game. I had, what, 270 free AP at the end of the game? That's 6,000 gold worth of stats. And how much gold do we have total? So I'm literally... Look at this shit, dude. I, I basically have 16,000 gold worth of stats. Like, I have, I have 6,000 gold in that AP. That's how much total gold their mid laner had. 
You see how ridiculous this is? So, pretty damn good. Like I said, I'd, spin, I'd finish it with a Visage, and then after the Visage, I'd get my Death Cap. So it'd be Morella Nomicon, probably go Visage, then Warmogs, and then run uh, Scaling HP Yellows in your runes as well. That way you trigger the Warmogs 2700 health, or 2750, whatever it is. And then get a Death Cap after, because you already have Morella Nomicon for AP, and then you'll probably have 300 plus AP. So your Death Cap will scale off of your passive and give you even an additional 30% of that. So your passive will be 400 to 450 AP. Pretty ridiculous. Anyways, GG Well Played. Hope you guys enjoyed that Tank Vigar action. Make sure to tune in next time. Peace.